everybody wants a six pack. Well, if people stopped eating like crap, they probably would have one. This is the doctor's after show for Monday, November 5th. I love this show. I watch it every day because there's always something I take from it that I didn't really realize before. Uh, Monday's episode was about fat tummy to flat tummy. They talked about a lot of things um, that could be preventing you or bloating you from getting a six-pack. They even had uh, some girl on there who wanted... Uh, she was really thin, but she still wanted a six-pack and she wasn't getting there. The one thing they didn't ask her about was her diet. Maybe she was eating all the right things. I don't know. Maybe she was... She obviously wasn't working out right because she had one one overdeveloped ab muscle like way up here and then the rest of them were all... I don't know what she was doing. But you definitely want to make sure that if you are going to work out the abs, you're not doing cr endless crunches. It's totally pointless. You want to work out the entire core and using like a plank position, whether that's um, up on your arms or on your forearms. And the second thing is your diet. I mean, it's kind of... It's not entirely true that you can not out-train a poor diet. Some people have the metabolism where they can eat whatever they want and then work out like crazy and they're still thin. But they're not going to be ripped. To really get those cuts, you have to eat like big chicken every day, basically. I mean, it's really, really boring, and not a lot of people are going to stick with it. That's why you see celebrities get, like, super ripped for a movie, and then by the time they're promoting the movie, they have a double chin. Because it takes a hugely restrictive diet in order to do that. But if there's one takeaway from today's episode that I had no idea, and I think it's a great tip, is to if you sprinkle parsley on your food, it prevents bloating. Who knew? I, I'd never heard of that before. So get some ground parsley, sprinkle that shit on everything, and at least you won't be bloaty. So that's what I took from today's episode. If you found something particularly interesting, tell me in the comments below. I know these videos are literally reaching threes of people, so I'm sure the comments are going to blow up after this. And sarcasm. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.